What's up, YouTube? This is our Rob78 again. Uh, these are my uh, Nintendo 64 uh, NES and uh, Super NES uh, games finds. Um, some of these I found at the Swap Meets, um, Goodwill's Salvation Armies, and uh, Craigslist. Uh, the first thing uh, was the system. Uh, I did find one on Craigslist for $25 and it came with a couple of games uh, but I sold that one off and uh, this one uh, is the one I found at a Goodwill with actually about 10 or 15 games uh, again some of them I already sold off and bought other stuff with it um, but yeah this one was about 40 uh, it did come with a couple of games and it came with the expansion memory expansion pack so and it came with uh, two controllers, uh, which is the the yellow one, which I still is still zip tied. You can see it. So I haven't uh, opened it up, and it still has the memory in the controller. The other controller it came with was with the blue one. So most of these I've cleaned and uh, tried to fix the joystick, so they work great. Um, they also came with one aftermarket memory card pack and it did come with the uh, trimmer pack also uh, different time I also found a um, an aftermarket Mako Pat 64 I think I got it for like four dollars three ninety nine and I know these go a little bit more than that so I got glad I got that one and with the original system that I had purchased the other N64 I got the atomic purple tried fixing the joystick it still kind of sticks a little bit but I'm gonna probably fix that again and this is the other one that it came with uh, the black one uh, some of the games that it came with was Star Wars Shadows of the Empire um, Resident Evil 2 Super Mario 64 the only bad thing about this one is one of the prongs is broken but of course it doesn't really affect the game um, Mario Kart 64, Castlevania, and No Mercy, WWF, and uh, WCW vs. NWL, World Tour, Gauntlet Legends, uh, Blitz 2001, Turok, uh, Mortal Kombat Trilogy, and I'm trying to look for one for the PlayStation 1. Now, having not so good luck finding it. Uh, if I do find it, it usually goes for above 15, so I'm trying to buy it cheaper. Um, also came with StarCraft 64. And the other system came with it also, but I sold that one off. I ended up just keeping this one. I couldn't sell this one. kind of dirty and messed up. Maybe the plastic, something melted on it. I don't know. It's weird. And... Conquer's bad for a day. So, those are my N64 stuff. And as far as Super NES, besides the other box games, I also had found a Tetris 2. So, I was only like $2, so I said, like, What the heck, let me get it. Um, then, these are the NES finds that I got at uh, Goodwill. Got Tech Mobile, I think I got it for like 99 cents. Ice Hockey, this one was a little bit more. It was two ninety nine. If you can see the price right there, but it was a half off sale, so I got it for you know dollar fifty. I also got Sight Bike. Um, forgot how much I paid for that one, and uh, this one my sister actually bought for me, uh, Metroid, and it was only one ninety nine. So yeah, that was cool. Runner. She got me Metroid. And I also got Mike Tyson's Punch. I also found it at a um, Goodwill. Uh, I've been looking for it, looking for it. Uh, I ended up buying uh, Punch Out, the, the second one. Didn't really like it. I ended up selling it off. And then that same day, I went to Goodwill and found Punch Out. So you can only pay like $3.99 for that. Um, I had purchased also an NES system, sold it off. Uh, kind of needed the money. But uh, I kept some of the games that were, came with it. Uh, kept Tetris, uh, Monopoly, 
and I also kept uh, Legend of Zelda. Uh, not really into the Zelda games, but I decided to keep it for nostalgic reasons. These games I purchased at Swamp Meet. Uh, actually, my brother got this one for me. Uh, RBI Baseball. It's a Tengen game. Good, decent condition, except for this little... Uh, what that is. little peel-up. Um, and bought these off... Uh, I think I got these four for ten dollars. Uh, Robocop. Uh, tag Team Wrestling. Uh, I got this for nostalgic reasons. This is one of the games I bought when I was younger. Uh, same as this one. TNC Surf Design. And Spy Hunter. So most of these are primarily nostalgic games. I, I still like them. I enjoy them. They're fun. And looking around in a bunch of my boxes I found my original Super Mario Brothers 3 um, yeah so I had a Nintendo a long time ago I ended up uh, sending it out to Mexico kinda regret it but I still have this game this is the only thing I had left so I think that's cool alright so these is these are my Nintendo finds and again rate comment subscribe if you want and I'll have more stuff coming up soon. Thanks.